Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a class attendance using AppSheet. So, um, in AppSheet, I'm I'm not going to customize it by myself. I'm going to create it using uh, AppSheet template. So, before we start, we're going to go to um, AppSeed.com So I click on this one Google AppSeed And then you're going to get start to log in if you have an account of logging into um, AppSeed and then you're going to log into and if you don't have an account for logging into AppSeed or register in AppSeed so you can click and get start um, and then you're going to choose which account you want to create with but in case I have an account of logging into AppSheet so I can go to sign in and then I click on Google and then we'll choose um, your email and then um, you click on your email and then click continue and then click allow this is going to allow AppSeed to um, access to your um, email information. So we'll get to this page and then um, you can explore template. So you can create um, app if you want to um, create it yourself and uh, customize it yourself and everything by doing it by yourself. But in this case, um, I'm going to explore template. So we choose the template to um, create it. It's just a little bit um, easy and fast and you just a uh, little bit of customize your apps or maybe you need to add some columns in, a, in, the, in the database and, um, and something like you're going to add some student in or something um, to add just a little bit customization. So just click on the explore template and you will see lots of different templates that you can choose like um, so this one is a, like a simple survey so you can create a survey simple inventory so you can create a very simple inventory just in a minute just using this template or maybe Kanban board or project trackers so um, onboarding and training shift management so there's lots of things to do, so um, station booking, travel approval workflow, field delivery, so lots of things. So um, I'm going to go to um, looking for, yes, this one, so class attendance. So this is attendance tracker apps have locks student attendance in a class. So this is helping you when you are teaching in a class with like a few different courses or maybe one course that's okay so maybe um, in the class you're teaching math history um, English or something so you add a course so every course who's in the class is joining the course who is missing so you just click one click and then you know who is um, so you can add who is coming who is not coming in the class so I can click in a preview or maybe so just click in a copy okay so copy and then you can um, change your apps name or maybe you can say um, a classroom attendant management or maybe but I'm gonna use this one um, um, maybe I can say attendance manage management so um, copy the apps Wait a minute. All right. So this is going to be perfect one. So just waiting for loading. All right. All right. Cool. So this is um in the template you might see three different courses. 
this is Albra, this is about um, triangle everywhere using mats or something else. So this is history and um, this is um, F sheet academic. So in this case you can change everything here or maybe you can add some more courses or about this one I can edit it I can click it and uh, I'm sorry I can um, click to edit at any time okay so you can add okay you can add this one here okay you can add courses so I can add um, for example English um, description or I might say um, uh, sorry learning English in one place okay um, I may need image so I'm gonna upload it get this one and then click save so saves it here I'm sorry um, I'll check it this one my display is too big all right so then we have um, this one you can remove this one if you don't like to you can change it at any time so this one you can add it anytime any courses you want so we have courses here and then attendance so here is the day you want to choose for the attendance so today or um, in a week in a month you can see who's gonna be in a in, in the course I'm sorry in the course so I'm gonna click today like this but um so for example in um, um, history class or history course you can click on it and then you'll see who's in the course so you may need to add people in the courses in to like so I have three um, student in the course so every day when your course start you may need to check the attendance by clicking on attending so I mean Eddie is attending so click on this one yep so loading and then um, if Mary is also attending, we we'll click on Mary, and then uh, Clary is not attending, and then you go back, and you will see what's happening, and then you're gonna go to this one and go to your Google Drive, and then you will see your database by um, Google Sheets. So you're gonna click on this one, and we'll see. Um, we'll see attendant logs, students, courses. So these are the courses you can edit here. Like you can edit to a different course. Like um, this is math, this is history, this is um, science, this is English that you can edit to. Or maybe you can add some more here by adding this one. Um, um, adding some pictures on it okay so student you can add some more student here so we have they have so um, they have Peter Fung Santiago 80 and some more so you can add some more people in if you like to you can add in here or maybe you can add from the app seats you can add from here or from the app seats so logging so in here it's recording every logging in into the the app into the course so this is the people i just um added into the classes so they they tell the times they um that they're logging in okay. all right so this is cool you can um in here you can sew in the desktop 
desktop mode and you will see this way attending okay so see in um, attendance so in um, today so today 18 so two people is joining um, the class okay so joining the uh, history class and in English you just add so there's no item yet so you need to add student in all right so who is in your English class so you add uh, for the first name last name headshot and email address and you can choose this one okay you want to add people in okay so for example I add um, um, Maria last name uh, L I don't know so you just pretending just um, well choose picture I don't know all right email at example dot com okay so which course is Maria Maria join so uh, English so you can click save and then this one you got Maria so next time in English class in English class Maria when Maria is joined English class so you can click attending and you add more people in the English class how many people you have in the English class you can add every people in and then every time you teach English classes click the attending by I'm clicking attending here to um, to add the people to the attendance so if I click here to attend yeah. so you can go to the database and you will see you will see she is in okay here okay English so um every recorded the show the date the time and the courses or the course that they join it's quite simple and then you can manage your courses or classes so this is for the course um, managing management it's fast and easy and simple okay so this is good so I also use this um, for my um, for my class as well but I'm teaching um, English so in my course I might add people in add my student in because um, in the class it may be um, there are some like about 25 students in the class so you can add those people like all the students into the into the course and then you attending every day you click um, who is in the course who is in the class it doesn't have to be like a big school but it's just a small school you can create this app to help you managing your students like you know the simple way it doesn't have to use a paper every day to check like who's in who's out every day it can be lost but this one is quite easy to help you managing your student it's clearly what time they're in what time um, if they are late they are late we will know that easily so um, thank you for watching um, if you have any question please comment down below the videos if you haven't subscribed yet click subscribe to update to watch my further videos thank you